<laughs> I woke up and I am a tad bit under the weather. I feel it's mostly a chest cold. I'm hoping it does not come into a head cold. But we're gonna we're gonna nip it in the bud today. We're gonna nip it in the bud. See, I'm gonna take some of this. Now, any Canadian is gonna know exactly what I'm about to experience. For you Americans or anybody else around the world, you just don't understand Buckley's until you experience it. Buckley's, as you can see, is cough and congestion. It is the nastiest, nastiest cough syrup you will ever, ever swallow. It is disgusting. But the thing is, it works. And I think for the longest time, their commercials even said it tastes gross, but it works, or it's disgusting, but it works. The only thing I can remotely say that it tastes like, well, I mean, it's just gross, but you know the Vicks of Vapor Rub? If you were to melt that and swallow it, that would be somewhat resemblance, resemblance, is that a word? Of the taste. It is nasty, but like I said, it works. I'm not sure if you can hear it, but my chest and my throat is just on fire today. So we're going to take a swig of this. Ah, oh, just the, mm-mm-mm. Uh, -uh -uh. Like, honestly, honestly, I, I don't even know. It's been a hot minute since I've been sick. It has been a hot minute since I've taken Buckley's. I can't even remember the last time I was this sick. Anyway, cheers. Oh, oh. Oh, 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 <laughs> it just burns. Oh, anyway, whoo, whoo, wow, that's good stuff. So I don't know what today is going to look like. I'm kind of just going to take one thing at a time. Right, oh, whoo, 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 right now I'm just going to chill. And, um, but I may, uh, obviously I'm going to make some tea later on and then I may or may not take a nap. I do have the app on in case, I don't even know if I even have the strength to go do an Instacart today, but we're going to, we're going to just play it one hour at a time, but, uh, I'm not going to do anything crazy for dinner. I do have Sam, Sam. I do have some chicken noodle soup back there, which I will probably make for lunch and dinner. I don't even know. I can't even think about food right now. All I know is I'm going to chill out. And uh, I was, I did have a fever this morning, but I took some Tylenols, so I'm hoping that will uh, break the fever. But um, yeah, good times, man good times. I knew this was bound to happen sooner or later. I was hoping for a little bit later, but it is what it is. So I am going to have my echinacea tea. Oh, it's still a little bit hot. Obviously, it just brewed. But 
I have decided that I'm going to opt out of today. I just don't have it in me to do any work. So I am going to... I, my chest is feeling better. Like it's not as heavy that um, Buckley's definitely helped. I've only been coughing about every 20 minutes instead of every two minutes. So that's a plus. I can still feel it though. I'm going to have some tea. But I feel like absolutely exhausted. Like I just feel like I can't keep my eyes open. So I am in a parking lot that's relatively quiet. I was going to go down to the beach, but it I don't want to get cold. And down by the beach is about 10 degrees cooler than it is up here. So I'm just going to hang out in the parking lot. I'm going to watch some Netflix. There's a movie that I want to watch. I can't remember the name of it. And uh, maybe take a little nap. Because like I said, even though I am feeling better a little bit, I mean, I can still feel it. But I feel absolutely exhausted. If I do decide to take a nap, I will put up, um, for those of you that don't know, I do have this great big blanket that I put up here. It's not a hundred percent, um, like you can still see above it, but I don't think anybody's going to look in my car and what are they going to see? It's just the top of the roof. I don't, I, you know what, at this point I don't even care. Anyway, I'm going to go drink my tea, chill out, watch a movie, and then I will see how I feel a little bit later. I'm not going to make any soup yet because I'm just, I don't have an appetite. I know I will need to eat at some point today, but like I said, I'm just going to make some, uh, I think it's chicken and rice that I have. <laughs> Tim Hortons brand, I think. Of course, there's a shocker. Ooh, do I want coffee today? I mean, I imagine I will need a coffee. But anyway, I took off my shoes. I'm in my living room slash bedroom slash office and I'm just going to chill. feeling too bad still super tired um, but my chest feels a little bit better and uh, I think it's time I think it's time to go get my coffee because well you know there's that but uh, I tried to take it up and I'm just I can't I'm not <laughs> I just can't I'm not I'm just not the person to nap I tried but uh, this is what it is. Anyway, coffee time. Coffee time. 
Okay, let's see. Tim Horton's chicken and rice. I think this is the winner, winner chicken dinner. I do have Italian wedding soup. Oh, that would be good too, eh? I love Italian wedding soup. What do I want? Chicken, chicken and rice better when you're not feeling well. Oh, whoa. Okay, that's the winner, winner chicken dinner. Listen, I know it would be so much faster and so much easier just to bust out my butane stove. But you know what? When I'm not feeling well, I just want to stick it in here and have no dishes. Oh my goodness, I can't do this with one hand. I just stick it in there. Yeah, get all in there. All that rice and chicken. And then I let that do its thing. Am I being 100% lazy? Absolutely. And you know what? I don't care. I'm going to have the soup. My friend who is also, I guess, nomadic, whatever you want to call us. <coughs> He's making us a... Uh... <coughs> grilled cheese sandwiches now honestly do I think the cheese will be the best thing to eat while I'm this sick no but you know what soup and grilled cheese like come on now and he's using it on his stove so he's gonna be doing all the dishes and stuff I'm so okay with that anyway I'm going to have my soup warmed up. I'm going to have that and the grilled cheese sandwich. I'm going to have one more tea this evening. <coughs> have one more tea this evening. And I am feeling a bit better. I'm absolutely exhausted. But I'm going to have an early night to bed. And then I'm going to kick butt working over the next three days. My friend is so kind for me. <coughs> Sorry, you guys. <coughs> so he actually made me two grilled cheese and ham sandwiches. I'm going to be stuffed, but with that being said, I'm also very, very hungry. You know what's very interesting? So to me, these are grilled cheese sandwiches, right? He's in a camper, so he has that luxury of like a stovetop and everything. But he calls them toasted cheese sandwiches. I tell you. So good though. So good. Anyway, I'm going to eat this. My soup's almost ready, so I'm going to dunk a little bit, you know, because that's how we roll. And then, oh, do up my window because it's getting cold. Watch a little bit of Netflix, and then it'll be bedtime. Okay, one thing I will say, Tim Horton's soup is definitely not as good as their coffee, but the broth, people, the broth, do you hear him laughing at me? I don't know why people laugh at me all the time. Anyway, I'm going to go eat my soup, but I just wanted to let you know because I do talk about Timmy's a lot. The coffee is way better than the soup. It's not bad. I don't know what I was expecting for a can, but it'll work. The sun has gone to bed and so must I. Holy crap, I don't think I have gone to bed this early in a hot minute. I don't even think it's 8 o'clock. But, when the sun went down, <laughs> so did my energy and everything else. And I started coughing really bad again. My chest started getting heavy again. And... 
you know, but it is what it is. Ooh. Hold on, un momento, por favor. Sorry, I have uh, really good people in my life phoning to check in to make sure I'm okay. Um, I don't even know what I'm doing. We need to put this up. I guess I'll wait till I'm finished talking to you guys before I bl Ow, block you. Yeah, so like I feel like shit, but that's all right. Um, we got another day tomorrow and hopefully I will feel better. Get a super good night's sleep and, um, you know, try again tomorrow. But wow, what a doozy. What a doozy. My throat is uh, really sore. My chest is really sore. But, uh, you know, the show must go on. No, my work must go on. I need to try to work tomorrow because uh, I don't like missing missing money opportunity days and stuff like that. But anyway, I am going to just cozy up. I am not, um, I was a little bit feverish earlier. I think that broke again. I took some Tylenol. Tylenol is actually pretty good for fevers. I will admit. And uh, I'm just going to hunker down and maybe do a little bit of editing. Maybe watch some more Netflix. I watched, um, what was it called? Oh my gosh, I can't even remember. This lady, search and rescue, going up into the mountain and saving someone. Indefinite storm? Something like that. Anyway, it was actually not too bad. Not you know, sitting on the edge of your seat, fantastic. But I like survival kind of movies and survival kind of shows and getting lost or climbing mountains and all that shit. Oh, my little corner is not in there. Oh. Get in there. That's right. See, this came in handy. And I need to move my little boot tray See, I have this that I put down to get in and out of my vehicle so I don't dirty my rugs because I am in a very, you know, rainy, muddy, city, nasty, so um, I just don't want all that crap getting onto my, whew, Getting onto my carpets. Anyway, not that my carpets are the cleanest. I really need to clean this. You know what I found is living in your vehicle, it gets like dirty like in a minute. I, I don't know why. I don't know how the dirt and everything gets so accumulated so fast. I have something down here protecting my carpet and my carpet is just trashed. When I redid the battery the other day, last week, whenever it was, I dusted, I cleaned, and it's all, I don't know. You know what? That's a future me situation. That is not a current situation. A current situation is just drinking lots of water, which I know I'm going to regret because I'm going to have to pee all night long. But, you know, they say keep you, keep lots of liquids going in you. So, I'm going to go do that. So, yeah. I'm going to leave this here, and I'm going to bid you all a good night, and I hope everybody's doing well and staying safe. Until next time.